In this part, we continue working on our apartment by learning how to use textures. I'm gonna use Blender Kit add-on. If you don't know how to use this add-on, check my tutorial how to use Blender Kit add-on. Link in the description below. First, let's add texture to our bathroom and toilet. In my opinion, the easiest way is to select this object and in edit mode, select all faces which you want to texture. Then I select all faces. I can separate these faces from my main wall. P on the keyboard. Go back to object mode and click on the separated object. If I go back to the object mode again, you can see the object is separated. In object mode, press Ctrl A, rotation and scale to normalize the object texture transform. But now let's move on into Blender Kit add-on. Here you can find tiles textures. This texture is looking great. Just drag and drop on the object. A few seconds to wait. And in edit mode press U to unwrap this texture. The tiles texture fits very well, so we can continue working and make walls, stucco or plaster material for all walls. In this example, I'm gonna use only nodes technique. Select this object and go to shading mode. Click on new. You can paint with wall only with color or use a texture from Blender Kit add-on. But if you make this texture only using nodes with no texture and bumps node, it will look pretty good and significantly reduce the time of rendering instead of using Blender Kit textures. So connect bump normal with principal normal and noise fuck texture with bump height. If I change this setting it gives quite different results. Also strength setting reduce bumps of a noise texture. Increasing metallic makes an object not so glossy. The rotness slider, the reflection more blurry. You just created your own texture. Now I can select my other object and easily apply this texture for this object or other objects. Just select an object and choose a texture from the list. These walls look not bad, but if you want a better result, internal and external wall colors should be different. The technique is the same as we used with tiles. Only need to separate faces from the main wall and apply textures from the Blender Kit add-on. I have to create a new texture for this internal wall. Settings almost the same, only need to reduce the scale and strength intensity because inside the house we want smoother wall. Using this method you can apply wallpapers, ceramic and other stuff on the walls. Later in this video you will see how to apply wallpapers on these walls. I hope you will find it useful. Thanks for watching it.